Hello everyone, it's Ava Shoshana. Today I have a video on this Marc Jacobs tote bag that I've been using for the past couple months. I'm going to go through the style and the color, the dimensions, and what actually fits in this bag. So if you're interested, stick around. So this bag is listed as a small or medium. When I purchased this bag, it was listed as a small, but now it's listed on the website as a medium. So this is their medium tote bag in the color slate green. A beautiful color, like an olive, an olive green. The front has the tote bag wording, Marc Jacobs. And in the back, there's this wording that they have. Let's see if we can get up close and see what it says. So in the back it says the Marc Jacobs style tote bag location NYC year 1984. So that's the back of the bag. And that's the side. The straps. As you can see, the hardware is in silver, and on the other side, there's this little handle that they have stitched on the side. Not sure what it's for, but I have used it. I'll show you how I use it. I've tried to put water bottles. I'm not sure if anything else will fit in there. I think a 16 ounce water bottle will fit there, but that's about it and my umbrella but that would just easily slide through so i'll show you how i use that little handle next i'm going to show you the straps comes in black it's very comfortable material doesn't hurt my shoulder after hours of wearing it easily adjustable i love to wear it at my waist I don't like my back to go below my waist so I keep my strap on the shorter side and I'm for those who don't know I'm around 5'7 right now it's time to look in the inside there is a top zip and one additional inside pocket zip not too large, perfect size, and it has two slip pockets. This little inside pocket does not come out, so it's not like the Louis Vuitton bag where the pocket comes out, like the pochette. No, it stays in. And that's it. That's the only additional storage they have inside of this bag. And it's about seven inches long, this inside zip pocket. I just cleaned out my bag before I recorded this video, so it's a little messy. So I'm gonna grab my Oreo vacuum and I'm just gonna clean the inside. Right now that my bag is cleaned, I want to go into the dimensions of the bag. So height is about 11 inches and the diameter is 6 inches and the length is about 13 inches. So it's about the same size as my Louis V dupe that I had that I showed years ago. So if you remember that video, they're about the same size. So now I want to go into what actually fits in this bag. So let me gather my things and let's get into it. So the first item I'm putting in is my emergency kit. Next up I have my mini wallet. Put that in there. Also have my passport. Slide that in there. I have my hand lotion. I also have my 
eyeglass cleaner for my glasses slide that in there and also my mask with the straps that I got off of Amazon so I just put them around my neck and I don't lose my mask because it's just hanging around my neck so yes these straps are very useful Next up, I have my portable soap sheets. You guys seen that before. I have a pen. Put that in there. I also have perfume oil. Video coming soon. I also have my water bottle, which comes in this very cute, convenient size that can easily slip inside the purse, as you can see very cute water bottle I've been enjoying it put that in there I also have my taser you guys seen this before slip that in there for now I'm also show you where I also like to keep my taser I also have my mini umbrella which I took out the car because it was raining I'm gonna put that back in the car once I head out Stick that in there, and I also have some lip gloss. Slide that in there. Last but not least, my Kleenex, portable Kleenex tissue, which I like to stick on this side handle. So that's basically what I've been using this side handle for. I'm gonna show you how I place it, and just click on. Click it in place, make sure I put it in the right direction, and that's where I keep my tissue. Now I also want to show you guys that I also keep my taser on the side where the tissue paper is. That way I don't have to actually dig through my bag. There's an emergency. It's right there and easily accessible for me to use. Now let's see the inside. See how much room I have left. A lot of room, especially when I take out my umbrella. And that's where I store my cell phone and glasses usually. But I'm reusing my cell phone to record right now. So yeah, that's everything that fits in my bag. Marc Jacob tote bag, size medium. And the color slate green. Alright, now I'm gonna zip up my bag, show you guys how easy it is to zip up. And the end of the zip, I like to keep mine inside the bag. I've seen other people keep it out like this, but I don't like the way that looks. So I usually just keep that side of the zipper inside the bag. And that's the top of the bag, even with the little openings on the side, everything is still secure. As you can see, nothing falls, nothing fell out. So yeah, your bag will be secure. And that is it, you guys. I've been loving this bag. I've been wearing it everywhere. And it's very comfortable to use. The material is like a canvas material. Very nice. I'm not sure how well it is when I clean it. I haven't had to clean it. I've been keeping it clean so far. But when I do clean it, I will make an update and I will show you guys. So that was my review and what fits in my bag. I want to say thank you for everyone. If you like what you saw, please subscribe and I will see you next time.